Welcome everyone to another video and in this video we are doing a challenge of dueling Metagross uh, and this is in neutral weather. Uh, we are using Moltres mostly and Entei. I think this one has um, yeah, Earthquake, there you go. Earthquake is neutral or not, a net resisted to for Moltres because it double resists because of its flying typing then is weak to because of its fire typing. Uh, Moltres is a great option uh, against uh, against Metagross because obviously Metagross is Steel Psychic and it's Steel its Steel typing is weak to um, weak to uh, fire and um, um, Sparkle Tangerines on the left as you probably already know and I'm on the right. Sparkle Tangerine only has three Moltres, that's why she's dodging right now. Try to get the most out of her Moltres, then she's gonna then finish off with Entei. Entei has like a lower attack stat. So that's why I um, prefer to spend more time on Moltres, even if it's dodging. So, gonna hit this overheat. And this is kind of fun. We want to do a, a few other challenges, but we're just looking for the right uh, Metagross in order to, to do it. And maybe perhaps find the right weather as well. So it's looking good there. We hit the overheat. I get the energy. Great, that's awesome. Hopefully Sparkle can get this overheat off before she faints. It's going to be close. This is actually, I think it's actually Windy boosted Zen Headbutt, if I'm not mistaken. Um, actually, I could probably, oh, she has a Charizard here. Actually, um, I'm actually not sure, actually, to be honest, if I remember this video. I guess I could have told if I looked at the video. Someone will correct me below, because it would have said Sky Attack was boosted. Uh, so, she's going to dodge with Charizard. Uh, good, effective dodging, and Charizard has Fire Spin, um, Blast Burn, which is the best fire move combination in the game. Once uh, Blaze can get it, Blaze can will be a monster at in uh, in these raids. Hopefully, I can get this. Uh, it's gonna be close. No, we're not gonna get this overheat off. Unfortunately, that's fine. And now she's on to Entei, and I'm on to Moltres again. I told her at this point in time that we don't need to dodge. She doesn't need to dodge because I want Entei is kind of like lacking in an attack stat. So I want to make sure that I'm trying to get as much DPS as possible. So it's going to be super effective against Entei and then be able to get straight into that overheat. That's great. That's really good DPS for us. It's enough going to, that should be enough to get us the win. Especially if there's an early earthquake here. We'll see. Or no earthquake. No Earthquake is fine too because it's going to allow me to hit this overheat. And we're good. We are good. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you guys did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see everyone in the next video. Thank you.